Hello and welcome to my channel Greenline Goddess Tarot. This is your daily reading for the 12th of May. I've got George in the background saying hello. Um, yeah, lovely, beautiful morning again. So great way to start the day with a little bit of a tuning in and a tune up, which is really fantastic. So let's see what is coming through for the day. We have the King of Pentacles. Okay, all this beautiful Taurus energy coming in. Let's get connected to our the physical, the physical body, to the earth with the King of Pentacles. But this is very much resources, somebody that um, has is managing resources in some way, shape or form. The Ten of Pentacles. Hmm. Interesting. This king has got it all at this moment in time. He's going, what resources have I got? I've got ten. I've got the ten pentacles. Okay. Oh, he's having a conversation with the king of wands. So the kings are coming out going, what are we going to do with this? We've attained something today. There's something really valuable that you are potentially attaining. Interesting with the high priestess and the four of pentacles. I haven't turned my ring, ring light on today because it, yeah, you get the better light outside. Anyway, so hopefully there's enough light on the cards. But we've got the Knight of Swords. Hmm, interesting. So a lot processing and going on through your mind. There could be some really interesting insights here today about what it is that you've attained, which is really fascinating. There's something here that the King of Pentacles and the King of Wands is, is um looking over it's got the four of pentacles next to it so it definitely could be around money and resources the king of wands might be saying i want to save money and the king of pentacles might be saying i want to spend money <laughs> i want i've got this ten of pentacles i want to use it and enjoy it and the king of wands is going well i want to save it with that four of pentacles so it's kind of interesting the high priestess is there um I really trust your intuition today with the high priestess coming through. It may be also saying that it's time to release something here with the four of pentacles. It's a little bit of what are you holding on to for fear of letting go? Because there's something really valuable you've attained today, whether it's some sort of valuable insight, whether it is something to do with an understanding or money or resources could come to you as well. It really feels like, yeah, that's an important energy to trust your intuition with the very strong intuitive messages are coming in about what you've attained and what you're ready to release and let go of. But there's also a lot to do with managing resources. That's something that's coming through and, um, you know, we kind of saw yesterday was a little bit of like slow and steady, thinking of the longer term future. And now it's like, okay, let's apply that. Let's see what, gather around what it is that you've got. And with resources, it can be, uh, you know, you have might have learned a lot. You know, this can be studying. This can be valuable life experience. This could be money, time, effort, energy, intelligence. It can be just a sense of humor, who you are. You've got something within you, this valuable resource that um, you can share with the world. The King of Pentacles is very generous as well. And so this King of Wands usually is pretty expressive and it's like stepping into some kind of stepping up in a way, stepping into a leadership or more has been asked of you when potentially you've been holding on and saying, no, this is all I want to give. So potentially the high priestess is showing you what things have been living in these kind of in-between spaces that are ready to kind of come up and out and be seen and to shine in the world. So yeah, very interesting. And like I said, with that Knight of Swords, there's fast moving energy. Things can happen quickly. I mean, well, yeah, inside your mind, at least. <laughs> that's something that's coming through because these other energies are a lot slower. The King of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, the King of Wands and the Four of Wands, they're really having a big conversation about, yeah, how are we going to move forward with this and what yeah, your conversation about the resources. But yeah, the Knight of Swords, there's this sense of determination that comes through with it as well, which is really nice, wanting to put some thoughts into action, but we're still kind of really having, 
yeah, putting some thoughts into action and what is the best plan to be using the resources in the best way that is expressing who you are or getting what it is that you really want from a situation. So interestingly, with the high priestess, there might be some, you might get little messages or synchronicities, like I said, that just kind of help you, point you on the right path today. So that's the reading for the 12th. Thanks so much for joining me. Please like, subscribe, share, leave a comment, usual little blurb, but I love your comments and I do really appreciate it and it helps with the channel growth and take care.